Hi friends, it's Andrea from Selena Freedom. Welcome back to the warehouse. Let's go over some auction totals. So our last auction just ended Saturday night. It is Monday afternoon. It was a smaller auction from being gone two weeks prior and then having a ton of pickups last week. We only had like 94 items in there. Normally it's double that. Mm, around 150, 200, the more the better. So let's go over total. Sold total at the end of the auction was $1,200, again, smaller about 15 of them did not sell and they're the ones that have been going round and round for weeks and weeks the blinds that i still have the roller shades they're in inventory i have so many of them i don't even move them in the inventory app there's 20 of each i probably have two pallets still have any touched i don't move them and it's hit or miss if they sell and i don't think any of them sold on the last one the other items that didn't sell are ones we've had multiples of they're a faucet hose. We have them in gray and black. I think we had 40 of them when they came in. We had 700 bids total, which is also lower than normal, but we had less items. Top selling item, green pan Paris pans. That's a tongue twister. Ceramic nonstick 14 piece cookware in blue sold for $122, which normally the pots and pans sell for more than that. They're expensive in general, four or 500 bucks for a good set. We've gotten, I think, $200 on them. I actually have more down the hallway that will be on the next auction, and I believe there's a few on the current one now. Another set of smaller pots and pans sold for 60 bucks. I think that one only retails for 200, and we always have items that sell for a couple of bucks, but they're the smaller can light covers. They're nothing big. Last week, I had tons and tons and tons of pickups. Probably the busiest week I've ever had also the coldest week. It is currently about 30 degrees, still have on four layers, and I've actually had less people picking stuff up today than normal, but it was also a small auction, which means we've gotten to move stuff down out of the hallway much faster than I did last week. It's also very icy outside. I've shoveled twice out there. Actually, one of my customers, who was fantastic, just salted our whole parking lot for us and didn't tell me. I saw a truck go by and then sent me a message like, hey, that was me just salting your parking lot. People are so freaking nice to me. So I have in the hallway still Christmas, Home Depot, Costco. I have one delivery coming in two days, but it's just another single item. And I have two more pallets of Costco stuff coming in. I think it's similar to the last two Costco we had deliveries that we've had, but just a few different things. I don't think there's as many pots and pans on that one. And, and there's more small appliances, which I don't know if I love those yet because I have to check some of them or if I don't check them and somebody wants to return them, even though we don't technically take returns unless it's item not as described, which I have done on accident before, but I have a, like, I have a Cuisinart K-cup machine right next to me and I wanted to try it doesn't work but somebody will still buy that i have googled how to fix it i just can't get it to work it has an air bubble stuck in the hose so that's okay so on the last auction it was a lot of bowls tons of mixing bowls serving bowls bowls with graters on top it's okay i like that stuff it's smaller it fits on the shelf and there was ceiling fans too a lot of different stuff which people have told me they've noticed and they like that because some in some cases the husband can get a ceiling fan and the wife can get silverware i mean best of both worlds. So just a quick little update today. Nothing too crazy. I'm going to rearrange this hallway more. I still have Christmas trees down there. I have my 15 foot Christmas tree that's supposed to be picked up this weekend, except the people who are buying it live in Michigan and they got like two or three feet of snow. We only got a few inches, but uh, I told them, please, no rush. I will hold on to it. I've talked to them every few days for the past month. I mean, you can see down my hallway, there's a path. You don't have to do the shimmy side to side. And a few of the things I have left over here, the Christmas stuff, dollars to donuts, they don't work. Like this Christmas tree, it's like a light up one for outdoors. I have five or six that I've tried to test and none of them have worked. And I have two more here. And I think there's another one down the end of the hallway. So plug them in, add them to the collection. I have nativity sets still, trees. Oh, light up snowmen. The last one sold on the auction for $52 and it did not work. I tried to plug it in. The sticker on the side said did not work. And the person who bought it is an electrician. I think they retail for like 200 bucks and he was super excited. He's gonna take it apart and put it back in his front yard next year and I'm sure you can figure it out. So that's it for this time. Just a short update. You guys know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you next time.